Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Venkatesh. I am a DevOps engineer. This is a DevOps Pro Junction YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to see about one of the topic with Bitbucket. One of the subscriber has commented like uh, he need a video related to uh, on Bitbucket creating the pull request and approving it. I never made the video, so I'm going to make this tutorial for him so let's uh, see and uh, let's dive into today topic before i'm making lot of videos with devops cloud aws etc i hope these videos are helpful if you find these videos are helpful give thumbs up subscribe my channel follow for the more videos it will be encourage me to make lot of videos let's dive into today topic so here uh, I have the Bitbucket repository. I already made video about it, how to do everything. So in this repository, I'm going to clone this code. Let's open my Visual Studio code. And uh, here I'm going to uh, open my terminal here. Um, then uh, here I'm currently under the D directory. Here I'm giving git clone command. Once I gave it, uh, the directory get copied and i let's i will switch into this directory before let's add that uh, directory into visual studio code go to file and uh, here i have the add folder to the workspace and uh, here is my d drive and here the directory give add so once i given add you can see here i have added this directory and uh, here is the directory and uh, let's uh, move on to this directory now i am currently under this dev directory which i cloned right now and you can see here i have total three files let's uh, give a uh, git branch uh, there are there is only the main branch and uh, let's give git status uh, nothing has done here i'm going to create a branch called pull test uh, this is my new branch and uh, here you can see like uh, git branch again there is a two branch let's switch into this uh, git checkout pull test now i switched into this uh, pull test branch but you can see here uh, we don't have any uh, pull test like that any branches with the console so this is what we have only two branches, which is even the test also, uh, but I cloned only the main. But what I'm going to do here, I'm going to do some changes with my uh, code. So I'm just uh, adding a dummy line for test. Then I just uh, save this one. Then uh, again, I'm going to give uh, a git status. You can see uh, the main.tf file, which is got modified. Then I will add this one and I will do the commit as well. Git commit iPhone M uh, testing for pull request. Let's do the commit. So the commit is completed. Again, I will give git status now i need to uh, push this to my uh, main branch for that uh, i'm currently uh, you can see i'm currently in the pull test which is my current branch let's push this one uh, git push uh, pull iphone test origin okay uh, please make sure you have correct access and right permission okay okay let's uh, git uh, push origin pull iphone test you have to give the origin first origin which is nothing your main branch and uh, so which is your url you can see that and pull test which is your current branch so now i have pushed this pull test um, branch into my bitbucket repo let's uh, do refresh once we refresh, uh, we can see here, we have the uh, branch called pull test. We have done it. Now uh, you can see here in the main.tf, we have the dummy line for test, but 
when uh, when you see with your uh, main branch if you go to the main branch and if you see here there will be a same script but you you don't have that your dummy line uh, which your script which you which you have added right so now what we are going to do we going to the pull test branch and here you can see in the left side there is an option called pull request you have to uh, give this pull request and here you need to create the pull request here what it is means uh, you are going to uh, create a pull request this pull request is going to uh, merge with your current branch which is your it can be the main branch uh, whatever uh, whatever you want to merge you can do that as well here i am merging from pull test branch to the main branch and here i am here you give command and uh, here you can give some description whatever you want and uh, here you can add the reviewers basically uh, in organizations what will happen uh, this is my personal account so that's why i don't have any reviewers here may you you will get your reviewers in your organization you have your lead and uh, you may have the team uh, team people so you can add their mail id when you click you will get those options you can just add those mail ids whoever want to review your pull request which means whoever want to review your code then uh, delete this branch uh, tick mark this one delete the pull test after the pull request is merged which means after the merge is completed this uh, branch will get deleted automatically so you are setting this as well once you give this uh, create pull request once you completed this pull request uh, so you can see here i have the rise the pull request here and uh, this is the uh, file change which i have done currently so this is the change which i have done so you can see here i, I this is the showing green right so the here only i have made the changes so if is i have the more files it will show it again here as well and uh, you can see one by one and uh, the reviewer what basically he will do he will uh, so consider like and uh, now i logged in with the reviewer so here you can see that i am the reviewer and i'm going to review our file so here what i will do here you can see the plus mark so here i will do some review comment um, 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 you can add a one more uh, comment so this is uh, you can add one more comment um, uh, test uh, and uh, request so something i have added you don't mind it what i have written so this is my comment here this is my start review so now uh, what i have done i have reviewed which means i am the another person now i have done the review so once you reviewed you can you will get the notification this person has done some review you can go and check the review is completed how he had given the comment you can do uh, reply or whatever uh, you can give like and um, you can create the task with uh, even though jira here and uh, if you can resolve once it is completed okay so you will get some resolve button here once you completed uh, so that's what you can do and you also you can see the comment viewed so this is what uh, done something with that so once you're done and uh, you can see this is only one comment currently we have and uh, the approval what will do discard the review so he will discard the review which means uh, he has disagreed with your review now what you have to do uh, you have to go and check again and uh, you can you can push it again from the your uh, Mm, uh, sorry you can go and edit the files uh, whatever you want uh, like uh, here you you can make the changes again and push it to the repo so so you will uh, and uh, you ha once you push it to the repo you will get it here and uh, you can uh, do the review and you can uh, do resolve it as well and now what you can do do it approve so you can see now i have approved uh, you can see here once it got approved it's showing like a someone is approved your repository and uh, now let's go to here um, so here you can see that we we will not have that uh, pull test branch let's see it 
uh, we have the pull test and we can do the merge as well right now so here you have to do the merge so once you approve someone uh, you can set it uh, three to four people need to do the approval once everyone is uh, done you can ask you can do the merge so here is the merge and close this current branch once i give merge this will get merge into your main branch um, so that the pull test branch will get deleted the pull request was updated and you can see here so this is now uh see we got deleted with the pull test branch and if you go to main branch and you can see this has got merged this is how like you have to raise a request and uh, you can do the reviews with others and uh, once it got approved you can do the merge as well once two to three people's got approved you can go for the merge as well so this is like you have to do with the bitbucket i hope this video is helpful uh, if you find this video is he uh, helpful give thumbs up subscribe my channel and follow for the more videos and uh, thanks for watching this video